Welcome to Smacky's Garage. Today, we're gonna to be looking at how to connect a charger to a car battery that's died. Let's start this video out with, why would you need to charge a car battery? So essentially, the car battery is not providing enough energy for your car to start, or it's completely dead. What could cause this to happen is leaving any interior lights on. It could be you let your vehicle sit for a long period of time. Potentially, you have an alarm system that uses a lot of electricity and a lot of energy, which is gonna drain the battery. Or you could have an alternator on the engine that is not currently charging the battery. Either way, after this happens, it's always good to check the health of the battery to make sure that it's working correctly and it's up to par for the vehicle. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna pop the hood or the trunk, depending on where the battery is. So typically you'd find the battery in the engine bay. It could also be in the trunk on some cars. So it's usually around the outside of the engine bay. For this vehicle, it's located right here. Next, we're gonna get our charger ready. I like the chargers that have a separated jumpers here from the main box. What this does is it helps isolate everything. So before I go ahead and I plug this in or plug it into the wall, I'm actually gonna plug this in. So I'm gonna use the red here and the black on the negative. It's always good to make sure that the red is positive on the battery and the black is negative. So always double check your connections so that you're going to the right location. So now that I have this done, I'm gonna unwrap the battery charger. I'm gonna plug it in. So for this, so I still don't have this plugged in yet. Now I'm gonna take this off, I'm gonna connect it, snaps into place. And then now that I have that fully set up, I can take this and I can plug in the AC side of the battery. Now you can see here the 12 volt light did turn on and you can see it's starting to charge. There's one light, one red light on. I like this charger, it has a, it does standard 12 volt batteries, it does lithium batteries, it has a lot of different options. Now this is one that I have been using recently in my vehicle. I'll make sure that I put a link to it in the description below. Okay, so now that we're fully charged and it's trickle charging, so I just have the green light flashing, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna disconnect the AC side first. Now, the reason why I'm disconnecting the AC side first is because I wanna make sure that there's no power left so that there's no sparks when I disconnect this. So I usually work my way back. I start with the AC, then I'll disconnect this, and then I'll take the clamps off. And that's it. That's as easy it is to charge a car battery. Thanks for tuning in to Smacky's Garage. I'll see you next time.